Hey guys, it's time to do a drop test of the Samsung Galaxy A 2017 series. So we have the Samsung Galaxy A5 2017 here. And then we have the A7. And we have the little baby Samsung Galaxy A3 as well. So all these are in different colors. So we're going to be testing this out here, their durability, and drop them three times in different uh, positions and uh, basically test out how durable they are in real life tests you know I will be doing it here this is a hard floor uh, perfect to test out their durability so let's get started okay guys so we're gonna start this test off with the Samsung Galaxy A3 2017 and uh, we're gonna dropping it first of all uh, on the back so the height is about about five feet you know it's a it's a waist high drop so let's get right into it and here we go in three two one boom let's take a look at the damage and as you can see we managed to shatter the back here right at the corner and as well as we have like a full spider web going all the way to the upper sides as well so basically you have to be really careful with this phone of course glass can break easily so um, yeah but the camera lens is uh, looking fine no scratch whatsoever so yeah that was the back test of the Samsung Galaxy A3 all right guys time for a backdrop for the Samsung Galaxy A5 2017 looking really good uh, right now so let's see if this one can handle uh, this drop or not so doing it in three two one go Now let's take a look at the damage and As you can see we managed to crack this one as well So we have a big big crack right at the corner uh, Which is just going all the way to the sides and uh, the camera lens again is untouched. I have to say, I mean, back is really weak on these phones. So, um, yeah, let's move on and try out the Samsung Galaxy A7 2017. Beautiful A7 2017, about to go down in a three, two, one, go. Oh my god, that was a really, really hard drop, and I can clearly see that this one sustained a really, really hard damage. I think the, the most out of all these three phones because it's big and it has, you know, more weight. So, yeah, we have main impact at this area, and it's uh, uh, spreading all over the phone, spider webs. Wow, look at that. It looks so beautiful. Almost feels like a design on the back so yeah that was the back of the devices and uh, now we're going to move on towards the side facing drop Samsung Galaxy A3 2017 going first uh, with the side facing drop I'm going to uh, make sure that I don't botch this so uh, dropping in three two one go Okay, let's take a look at the damage and uh, as you can see the main impact was down here and we do have a dent at the right corner so uh, other than that can't really see any problem on the phone. Galaxy A5 2017 side facing drop in 3, 2, 1, go. see the damage and uh, it went straight uh, at the bottom just like that we have a scratch as you can see and then it got dropped on the face so luckily we don't have any scratch on the front display which is a nice thing so yeah the a5 2017 pretty much survived this drop as well without any major issues so moving on all right guys final side facing drops we have the bigger boss samsung galaxy a um 7 2017 i'm gonna drop it in three two one go
This drop was very similar to the drop of the A5 2017. So I'm um, just gonna look at uh, the, the damage. So um, yeah, I mean, uh, just like the other devices, we have a little bit of a damage uh, at the bottom edges, edges, you know, it's like a small scratch. But other than that, uh, it fell uh, on the front like that, wham. So can't really see any scratch on the front of the phone as well. So yeah, I mean, this was uh, the side racing drop was the best on the A7 2017. So uh, yeah, let's get moved towards the main drop that you all want to see, which is the front facing drop. Starting with the Samsung Galaxy A3 2017 front facing drop, the moment of truth. So doing it in three, two, one, go. Okay guys, I'm nervous. Let's take a look at the baby galaxy here. And let me just focus real quick. There we go. So, oh my God, there is a scratch at the top right, uh, top left corner. So as you can see, we have the, the impact there and then the spider webs going a little bit across the display. And other than that, there is not much of a damage so yeah it did a great job but i have to say i mean they are cracking at every drop uh you know front or back so really i mean you ha you gotta use like a protector if you're gonna use them you know as your main phone so yeah a3 2017 front facing drop moving on to the galaxy a5 all right we have the beautiful samsung galaxy a5 2017 you can see the display looks so so gorgeous so boys and girls time for a front facing drop and uh, it is going to be ugly i just feel it that uh, this phone can crack up so let's see here three two one go That was a really, really nasty fall right there. And uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh my God. Let me just zoom out. And as you can see on the front, oh my God, this phone actually survived. We just have a little bit of a, a damage right here. But apart from that, the display is looking super crazy good. No damage whatsoever, not even a slight scratch. Wow, I did not expect that. But yeah, the A5 2017 survived uh, the, the brutal front facing drop. So moving on to the bigger brother, which is the Samsung Galaxy A7 2017. Beautiful, beautiful display. You can see no scratch at all. So let's drop this phone front facing right uh, on the floor in uh, three, two, one, boom. Oh my God. There is no way that this phone survived. There has got to be a ugly, ugly smash scratch and moment of truth. Oh my God, look at that, wow. The display got cracked and you can see right at the area of home button, you know, it just smashed and the spider web spreading all across the display. You can see that it still works. I mean, the touch and everything is still working. Can't see any problem with that. So, but but yeah, I mean, this one t took the most fall because obviously it has uh, the most weight. And that's why, I mean, when you drop it, it just, I mean, it, it's not going to survive. The A7 is like the most um, weaker, you can say, out of all these phones. So, so thank you so much for watching this drop test that we did here of the whole A2017 series. Uh, please like this video if you enjoy it and share it as well. And if you're new to the channel, then uh, please subscribe. So overall, as a result, I would say that uh, you should, you must use like a case with these ones. And, uh, and uh, I mean, definitely this, uh, they, these, these phones are not as durable as the Galaxy S7, even though they have designed like the S7, but they're not as durable. So uh, we have the A3, 
sustained uh, damage on the back. The A7 sustained the most on the back. Beautiful spider webs going all over. And then we have the A5 2017 also have this damage, but literally I can't feel any any scratch uh, on the surface. Like it's like it's like internal cracks, you know. Uh, on the front, the A5 survived like a boss. I'm proud of that. The A7, you can see, it is literally ugliness, you know. It just not survived because of its weight. And then we have the A3, which also survived, but it has a scratch at the top right corner. So, um, yeah, this was a really brutal drop test of the Galaxy A 2017 lineup. Again, thank you so much for watching this video for, uh, for everything. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.